Ed Greenwood born July 21, 1959, is a Canadian-born fantasy writer and the original creator of the Forgotten Realms game world. He began writing articles about the Forgotten Realms for Dragon magazine beginning in 1979, and subsequently sold the rights to the setting to TSR, the creators of the Dungeons & Dragons role-playing game, in 1986. He has written many Forgotten Realms novels, as well as numerous articles and D&D game supplement books. Topic Early life and the Forgotten Realms Ed Greenwood grew up in the upscale Toronto suburb of Don Mills. He began writing stories about the Forgotten Realms as a child, starting in the mid-1960s, they were his dream space for swords and sorcery stories. Greenwood conceived of the Forgotten Realms as one world in a multiverse of parallel worlds which includes the Earth. He imagined such worlds as being the source of humanity's myths and legends. Greenwood discovered the Dungeons and Dragons game in 1975 and soon became a regular player. He used the realms as a setting for his campaigns, which centered around the fictional locales of Waterdeep and Shadowdale, locations that would figure prominently in his later writing. According to Greenwood, his players' thirst for detail pushed him to further develop the Forgotten Realms setting. They want Ed it to seem real and work on honest jobs and personal activities until the whole thing grew into far more than a casual campaign. Beginning with the periodical's 30th issue in 1979, Greenwood published a series of short articles that detailed the setting in the Dragon magazine, the first of which was about a monster known as the Cursed. He wrote voluminous entries to Dragon magazine, using the realms as a setting for his descriptions of magic items, monsters, and spells. Topic partnership with TSR In 1986, the American game publishing company TSR began looking for a new campaign setting for the Advanced Dungeons & Dragons game, and assigned Jeff Grubb to find out more about the setting used by Greenwood in his articles for Dragon magazine. According to Greenwood, Grubb asked him, Do you just make this stuff up as you go, or do you really have a huge campaign world? He answered, Yes, to both questions. TSR felt that the Forgotten Realms would be a more open ended setting than the epic Dragonlance setting, and chose the realms as a ready made campaign for AD&D 2nd edition. Greenwood agreed to work on the project, and began to prepare his Forgotten Realms material for official publication. He sent TSR a few dozen cardboard boxes stuffed with pencil notes and maps, and sold all rights to the realms for a token fee. The following year, Greenwood used this material as a basis for writing the Forgotten Realms campaign set along with co-author Jeff Grubb. The campaign setting was a major success, and Greenwood continued to be involved with all subsequent incarnations of the Forgotten Realms in D&D. He retained the rights to his fictional universe and went on to write numerous Forgotten Realms novels. Many of these center around the wizard Elminster, whom Greenwood has frequently portrayed at conventions and gaming events. Greenwood feels his work on the realms that he likes best are those products that impart some of the richness and color of the realms, such as the novel I wrote with Jeff Grubb, Cormier, The Volo's Guides, Seven Sisters, The Code of the Harpers, City of Splendors, and stuff that lots of gamers have found useful, such as Drow of the Underdark and Ruins of Undermountain. He found that it has been easy to keep his enthusiasm for the realms over the years, as so many people care about it, ask him questions about the world's law, realms law and share with him what they have done. He has stated that the Forgotten Realms, as run by him in his own games, is more dark and edgy than it is in officially sanctioned, published works. Greenwood has also been contributing editor and creative editor of Dragon Magazine. Personal life and other activities Greenwood has published over 200 articles in Dragon Magazine and Polyhedron Newszine, is a lifetime charter member of the Role Playing Game Association network, and has been Gen Con Game Fair Guest of Honor many times. Greenwood has written over 35 novels for TSR, and written, co written, or contributed to over 200 books and game products from other publishers. Greenwood has also contributed to The Book of All Flesh 2001, an anthology based on All Flesh Must Be Eaten, and written short stories based on the Silver Age Sentinels role-playing game. Greenwood's Castlemorn setting was published by Margaret Weiss Productions. He is co-creator with fantasy novelist Lynn Abbey of the Mournmist fantasy setting. He has also contributed to most Forgotten Realms gaming accessories, and authored many more—including the detailed Volo's Guide series—and continues to DM his own campaign. He writes regular Realms Law columns for the Wizards of the Coast website. 
In addition to all these activities, Greenwood works as a library clerk and sometimes as a librarian and has edited over a dozen small press magazines. When not appearing at conventions, he lives in an old farmhouse in the countryside of Ontario. As of 1998, Greenwood lived in apple growing country on Lake Ontario, still working full time at the North York Community Library, as he had since 1974, and continued to run his original Waterdeep campaign with the same core group he started with, albeit meeting only sporadically. He has stated that it is important for people who do freelance writing for role playing games to be active as both players and as dungeon masters. Topic awards and honors Greenwood is an award winning gamer best player 1984 Gen Con AD&D Open Tournament and game designer several Gamers Choice Awards and Origins Awards He was inducted into the Gamers Choice Hall of Fame in 1992 and the Academy of Adventure Gaming's Hall of Fame in 2003 Topic <laughs> Bibliography <laughs> <laughs> Chandrill's Saga Spellfire 1988 Crown of Fire 1994 Hand of Fire 2002 The Elminster series Elminster The Making of a Mage 1994 Elminster in Mythdrana 1997 The Temptation of Elminster 1998 Elminster in Hell 2001 Elminster's Daughter 2004 Spellstorm 2015 The Shadow of the Avatar trilogy Shadows of Doom 1995 Cloak of Shadows 1995 All Shadows Fled 1995 The Cormier Saga Cormier a novel 1996 Death of the Dragon 2000 The Harpers Crown of Fire 1994 Stormlight 1996 Double Diamond Triangle Saga The Mercenaries 1998 The Diamond 1998 Sembia The Burning Chalice The Halls of Stormweather a novel in 7 parts 2000 The Knights of Mythdrana trilogy Swords of Evening Star 2006 Swords of Dragonfire August 2007 The Sword Never Sleeps November 2008 the Sage of Shadowdale series. Elminster Must Die, August 2010. Bury Elminster Deep, August 2011. Elminster Enraged, August 2012. The Sundering. The Herald, 2013. Other titles. Silverfall: Stories of the Seven Sisters, 1999. Death Masks, 2016. Topic. Anthology novellas One Comes Unheralded, to Zerta", originally written in 1967, published in Best of the Realms 2 2005. "'Elminster at the Mage Fair", Realms of Valor 1993. "'So High a Price", Realms of Infamy 1994. "'The Eye of the Dragon", Realms of Magic 1995. A Slow Day in Skullport", Realms of the Underdark 1996. The Whispering Crown", Realms of the Arcane 1997. The Place Where Guards Snore at Their Posts", Realms of the Deep 2000. When Shadows Come Seeking a Throne", Realms of Shadow 2002. Lord of the Darkways", Untold Adventures 2011. Topic: Non-Forgotten Realms novels. Band of Four series. The Kingless Land, 2000. The Vacant Throne, 2001. A Dragon's Ascension, 2002. The Dragon's Doom, 2003. The Silent House: A Chronicle of Aglatha, 2004. Falconfar series. Dark Lord, Solaris Books, 2007. Arch Wizard, Solaris Books, 2008. Falconfar, Solaris Books, 2010. Novel of Nilheim series. Dark Warrior Rising, a novel of Nilheim, Tor Books, 2007. Dark Vengeance, Tor Books, 2008. Pathfinder Tales series. 
The Wizard's Mask, Peso Publishing, 2013. The Iron Assassin, Tor Books, 2015. Helmore series. Helmore, Your World Is Doomed. The Ed Greenwood Group, 2016. Helmore, Throckmorton's Trick, The Ed Greenwood Group, 2017. Helmore, My Talons in Her Throat, The Ed Greenwood Group, 2017. Stormtalons series. Words of Unbinding, The Ed Greenwood Group, 2016. Folklore, The Affliction series. Folklore, The Affliction, The Whispering Skull, The Ed Greenwood Group, 2017. Topic: Other fiction anthology contributions. The Sword of Dreams, Tales from Tetherdrill, 1998. The Witch of the Dawn, Be Afraid, 2000. The Shadow of a Sword, The Doom of Camelot, 2000. One Last Little Revenge, The Book of All Flesh, 2001. Writhe, Damn You, Northern Horror, 2002. No Stars to Steer By, Oceans of Space, 2002. All One Under the Stars, The Backer Anthology, 2002. O oh Silent Night of Cards, Be Very Afraid, 2002. The Secret in the Cellar, The Book of Final Flesh, 2003. The Man in the Wall, Path of the Just, 2003. The Fallen Star. Children of the Rune 2004 Storm Song Summoned by Destiny I Realms of Wonder 2004 The Mad MOHJ of Onteth The Dragon's Return 2005 Wrathclaw's Wyamtide We Three Dragons 2005 Beowulf and the Wraith The Further Adventures of Beowulf Champion of Middle-earth 2006 It Came from the Swamp Astounding Hero Tales 2006 King Harrowhelm Heroes in Training 2007 Father Mame's Best Catopolis 2008 What Dreams May Go Lilith Unbound 2008 How Fear Came to Ornith Worlds of Their Own 2008 A Perfect Night to Watch Detroit Burn Grants Pass 2009 Rescuing the Elf Princess Again, Gamer Fantastic, 2009. Edge of Moonglow, Tesseracts 15, A Case of Quite Curious Tales, 2011. Biting a Dead Man's Hand, First Contact, Digital Science Fiction Anthology 1, 2011. My Silent Slayer, Heir Apparent, Digital Science Fiction Anthology 4, 2011. Daggers in Her Garters. Beauty Has Her Way, Dark Quest Books, 2011. Best Served Flash Frozen, Foreshadow, W.S. The Ghosts of Zero, 2012. Midnight Night, The New Hero, 2012. A Girl and Her Scaly Bits, The Awakened, 2013. Fay Blades for the Dread Duke, by Fairy Light, 2013. The Sword of the Lord, Arcane Synthesis, 2014. Ghosts Galore, Cadaver Bone, 2014. The Dragon, Gods, Memes and Monsters, 2015. The Magpie, Gods, Memes and Monsters, 2015. The Haunting of the Lordly Lion, The Bard's Tale, Stories and Recipes from the Black Dragon Inn, 2015. Many Tentacles Reaching, The Awakened 2, 2016. My Doom May Come Soon. Champions of Etultis 2016 Wolves Run by Night The Awakened Modern 2017 Under the Queen's Throne Art of War 2018 Three Aces for the Dancer Rocket Age Anthology 1 Tales of the Solar System 2018 Words to Die For Sisterhood of the Blade 2018 Topic Anthologies edited When the Hero Comes Home edited by Ed Greenwood and Gabrielle Harboey Dragon Moon Press 2011 When the Villain Comes Home edited by Ed Greenwood and Gabrielle Harboey Dragon Moon Press 2012 Women in Practical Armor edited by Ed Greenwood and Gabrielle Harboey Evil Girlfriend Media 2017 
Topic: Video games. JRR Tolkien's The Lord of the Rings, Volume 2: The Two Towers, Interplay Productions, 1992. Pools of Radiance. Baldur's Gate. Haunted Halls of Evening Star. Mages of Mistralia. Topic: Media mentions. Ed Greenwood has appeared in the following newspaper and magazine articles, websites and podcasts. Topic: Podcasts. Open Design, Open Design 004, Dwarves of the Iron Crags. Ed provides the voice for the introduction to this show. RPG Countdown, Ed appeared on these episodes, 29 July 2009 Cobalt Quarterly 010. Dicecast Episode 10 by Polymancer Studios. Topic: Magazines. To believe the magic is real, a conversation with Ed Greenwood, Clarksworld Magazine, December 2008, interview with Ed Greenwood, CRYPTYCH Magazine, Issue 1, IV, February 1994, ISBN 1-8837730322. Topic. Further reading Ed Greenwood, 10 Minutes Interview on Sounds Like Canada. CBC Radio 1. 28 August 2007. Archived from the original on 12 October 2007. Retrieved 8 October 2007.